Good day, my darling. Welcome to my channel. This is Karina. Today, I would like to share to you how do I do my everyday makeup look. Matte, natural, very dear makeup. Step number one, always start with a clean face and don't forget your skincare routine. Step number two, corrector. I do have a dark under eye. So I use orange or dark peach to lighten the dark areas such as under eye, around my nose and around my lips. And don't forget to blend. The brush that I use for blending is MAC 2245. Just blend, blend, blend. Step number three, concealer. You can use the concealer before or after the foundation. The product that I use is Maybelline Fit Me. I like this concealer because it doesn't make me feel cakey doesn't make me feel heavy it's just blend perfectly with all the product that I use and don't forget to blend I use beauty blender to blend my concealer but you can use any product you have you can even use the brush or use your finger or any sponge makeup sponge that you have whatever your heart desire step number four foundation It's a winter time here in Hong Kong so my skin is a little lighter so I'm using MAC NC40 today but in the summer I use MAC NC42 because my skin is more natural tan it's lovely or I don't use makeup at all and don't forget to blend step number five eyeshadow I'm using the BYS eyeshadow palette in color mocha this palette is perfect for all skin color I bought this one in the Philippines and for the brush, I'm using the Sigma 55 eyeshadow brush. I love this color, but I cannot tell you what color is this because at the back of the packaging of the eyeshadow palette, there's no name written on it. So eyeshadow number two is a champagne pink, and I use the other side of the brush. This is a very lovely color. And now for blending. For blending the eyeshadow, I use my MAC 217. The next step is the powder to seal the foundation. Next step is contouring. I use the Hola Toasted by Benefits. I like this one because the packaging comes with the brush. So don't forget to contour your forehead, your cheek, your jawline. Contouring is a technique for sculpting and adding dimension to our lovely face. Next step, contouring the nose. I use my MAC 217 to contour my nose. After sculpting my nose, I like to blend it with my fingers because it gives more the natural looks. For liquid line, I use a K-Palette brand from Japan. This liquid liner is absolutely a must-have because they never smudge, waterproof, humid proof, definitely last long. And the good thing about this um, liquid liner the brush is very skinny so it's very easy to use you'll never go wrong with this one if you're gonna do a cat eye look this is perfect for that Okay, the next step is follows of lashes. This is not one of my favorite actually because putting on eyelashes is like going to the battlefield. I bought these lashes in the Philippines. One box comes with 12 pairs and it's only 50 pesos. So today I want it to look like a little bit more dramatic. So I add eyeliner on my upper lid. The brand that I use is Istolude in color dark brown. Or I think this is color cappuccino, dark cappuccino. 
after the lashes i like to curl my false lashes yes you can curl your false lashes they won't break and after that one i add a little bit more of eyeliner to my eyelid curl lash again and then yes you can tap a mascara on your false lashes me i'm using my favorite mascara which is the maybelline and for the eyebrows i like to use mascara just like that very simple very easy no difficult trick i like it to look more natural we are almost done so it's lips time before putting on my lipstick i use birds bees bee wax lip balm and the lipstick that i use is today this is one of my favorite at the moment the Hoda beauty in color last night i like this color because this color is really complement my skin tone and actually blend well whatever eyeshadow i use or whatever color or dress that i use so this is my favorite at the moment so we are finished i have time to do my hair see you in a bit thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe and please don't forget to hit the bell button so that you will be notified when i will be uploading a new video